Introducing Blackview DR900S two-channel, the first dual-channel dash cam featuring 4K Ultra HD. Blackview redefines dash cam visual fidelity with four times the full HD resolution. Combined with high shutter speed and a wide angle of view, the 4K resolution makes a world of difference. Zoom in on crucial details like license plates and images stay sharp. The best part? Blackview integrates the latest video compression technology, so even with four times the resolution, you can record for as long as with a regular full HD dash cam. And with 5 GHz Wi-Fi and optimized video substreams, video transfer to your phone is blazing fast, whether you connect to your dash cam directly or through the cloud. Blackview DR900S 2-Channel, redefining dash cams. Find yours at www.blackview.com. Speed and red light camera ahead. 
speed limit is 70 miles per hour. Mobile speed camera zone. This is the Yi Ultra Dash Cam. This is how you set up your Yi Ultra Dash Cam for the first time. Let's start by unboxing it. So, in the box, you're presented with the camera, which looks really nice and shiny. And within the box, you have two smaller boxes. And the smallest box contains the USB car charger, as well as the 3M mount, which you'll use to stick your dash cam to your windscreen. The smaller, flatter box has a long micro USB cable, as well as a prying tool. You also get a micro SD card, which you'll plug straight into your dash cam. Just like that. So let's set up the dash cam, shall we? Begin by peeling off the 3M sticker. Position it so that the flat side is at your windscreen. Try and position your mount so that it's not blocking your windshield and you have a clear view of the road. The higher the better. Now, take your dash cam and screw it on the mount. Don't forget, righty tighty, lefty loosey. Adjust the knobs until the dash cam is facing the direction that you want it to. Then, take your USB charger and plug it into your car. Grab the micro USB cable now and plug it into your charger. And the last step is just plugging in the micro USB to the dash cam. And there it is, it's working. When you turn on your car, your dash cam will turn on and start recording at the same time. So you don't have to press any buttons. That way you can just get on the road and start driving. Now that we've got it set up, I'll see you on the road.